The U.S. continues to see an alarming threat to Jewish communities in the country and says targeting Jews is unacceptable, White House Press Secretary Karine Jean-Pierre said on November 8. U.S. officials and civil rights groups have warned of increased threats against Jews, Muslims and Arab Americans following the October 7 attack by the Palestinian militant group Hamas in which Israel says 1,400 were killed and more than 240 taken hostage, and the ensuing Israeli bombardment of the Hamas-run Gaza. Strip, where Palestinian health authorities say more than 10,000 people have been killed. The president strongly condemns these brazen acts of anti-Semitism and has repeatedly made clear targeting Jews because of their beliefs or their identity is unacceptable. Make no mistake, we will continue to speak out against hate of every, every dimension. And that is why, just last week, you heard from, you heard from this administration, the president and vice president uh, announced that the administration will develop the first U.S. national strategy to counter Islamophobia in the United States. Anti-Semitism, Islamophobia, and other forms of hate have no place in America, and we strongly condemn anyone who seeks to harm Jewish, Muslim, Arab, and Palestinian American of, or any or any other communities, and we will certainly continue to speak out. Good afternoon, everybody.